Far, far away, beyond the horizon, and even further, there stood a palace of such brilliant beauty that nothing could compare with it. The palace was built of the purest gold. When the sun hid its walls, one could, even on the far side of the horizon, discern a glowing light. Behind the palace, there was a magical glacier. Every time the light from the golden walls hit the glacier, a piece of ice melted and dripped. These drops of water were collected in a vault deep inside the palace. They were the purest drops one could ever imagine. They could heal anything. This was the water of life. The shimmering light in the distance made many set out on a search. They wanted to find out if the magical golden palace really existed, but no one ever returned home alive. Because on the throne sat a greedy and avaricious king. With his mighty guardian, he watched over his treasures. Nothing was to be shared with anyone. No one else would ever drink from the water. No one would ever be allowed to enter his palace. You may have heard the name, but you have never seen it. The Palace of Soria Moria. Which one of you decided to chop down that tree? My fault. <laughs> huh. You are fired. And you could just forget about this month's pay. Hey. What do you say you just give him a warning? Are you seriously telling me how to do my job? Huh? Okay, you're all fired. What? Me too? Yes, you could thank Espen for that. Okay. And so Espen took the blame. You did what? My friend Niels needed that job, Dad. You speak as if we didn't. We need the money. What do we do now? Good question. It's not easy when Esmond always ends up in trouble. Always. Huh? Who on earth is that? Hmm? Yeah. Hello? I'm sorry, I think we're lost. <laughs> Could you tell me the way to the home of, um, even Hashlid? Maybe mm -hmm. you mean <laughs> Espen Ashlad? I don't think so, Espen. No, no, no. I mean Eskin Ashpot. You're absolutely sure you don't mean Espen Ashlad? Espen? Yes, it's right here. Uh, it says, to Espen Ashlad. Yeah, that's me. Um, really? Yeah, that's me. And this is our farm. Right. Um, hmm. 
to Espen Ashlad and Brothers. You're invited to the ball in the royal palace to celebrate my 19th birthday, signed by Princess Kristen. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> we had too much food prepared, so we decided to invite you. Does it say that? No, I made that up myself. <laughs> You're going to a party, <laughs> lads. Let's go. We're going to a ball. Bye. I don't really get why we're invited. Are you kidding? Didn't we save Kristen from the troll? Yeah, mm -hmm. but that was so long ago. Not that long ago. We'll probably be the guests of honor. You think so? Oh, yeah. But we have to look really good. What are we gonna wear? Wear to the dance? Uh, how do you greet a king? Bow to him, curtsy, party clothes? We'll fix it. There's nothing to worry about. Let's see. There you go. Thank you. <laughs> Hi. Hi, Mom. You're so pretty. Thank you. Many prominent people will be here today. Yes. I just hope I know how to speak to them. <sighs> You'll be just fine. I just wish I had the chance to decide what to do on my birthday. Please remember, our personal needs come second, my dear. Yes. Kingdom comes first. Mm-hmm. <laughs> hey, Dad, this feels... <sighs> Look at these stately fellows. Do I know you? What have you done oh, with my sons? <laughs> <laughs> Better get going. Enjoy the party. Espen? Yeah? Ah. Did you remember your tribute? Yeah. Do you think she'll like it? Yes, I hope so. I was your age when I first met your mother. It was at a party, but not a royal one. No. <laughs> There'll be a lot of royals there. We're not gonna fit in. But Espen, you just... have to be yourself. Pop up! Come on! We'll be thinking of you! Behave yourselves! You're not going to a barn dance! Uh, I think I'll go get something to eat. Count Gustav of Gotaland. There she is. Happy birthday, your beautiful highness. <laughs> I'll go say hi. Great. The Grand Duke of Flanders. We need more plum wine over there. Philip the Great of Copenhagen. I'm not the servant. Hmm. Hmm. Ow. Mm. Mm. Hi. Hi. <laughs> nice to see that someone appreciates the food. My pleasure. <laughs> Would you? So would you like to have a dance? Who, me? <laughs> um. Um. Pear, where are you? Help. Hang up my coat. The mayor of Byzantium. But. Shouldn't leave me alone here. <laughs> uh. Hmm? These people are a bunch of snobs. You know what? If I were king, I'd organize real parties because this, this is to be served to the uh, king and queen. But I 
Don't just stand there. The Earl of Holland. All right. Lying. What was your name? Uh, Espen Ashlad. Yes. Esklid to Husgland. <laughs> Espen. Hi. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, nice party. <laughs> I really wanted to go hunting, but they insisted I have a party. <laughs> oh, I, I am. Um, I, I brought a little gift. Oh, of course. Prince Raoul of Catalonia. It's not much, but. Uh, <laughs> Out of my oh. way. Princess Kristen, I'm Raoul, Prince of the Reign of Catalonia. My a dear, who are all those peasants riches. that somehow got invited? It's Kristen's day. Here? She invites who the she Duke wants. The Duke of Normandy! <laughs> the Baron of Bohemia! Look at this peasant. We don't fit in here. Let's go home. No, Fine with me. Yeah. Your Majesty, mm -hmm. it's time for your speech. Yes, of course, Vane. Thank you very much. Please come closer. Come closer. His Royal Highness is about to give a speech. <laughs> if you would. Hmm. Welcome, my dear guests. Let us raise our glasses and drink a toast to my daughter, the birthday girl. Cheers. 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 <sighs> my sweet daughter, Kristen, you are an adult now, but it seems like only yesterday when we cradled a little bundle of joy in our arms. I have no idea where those years have gone, Time is something that we can't understand. Somehow we think it will last forever. But then it slips through your fingers. Suspicious. Did you drink from it? No. Good. Him. He served the wine. I saw him. Hey, wait I a minute. I saw you. No, it was not I heard me. That's not if true. If I were king, we'd have real festivities. No, uh, he disguised himself as a servant to get close to the royals. I said if I were king, nothing else but if. Anyway, why would I want to do such a thing? I'm not like that. You people don't they know me. They should be thrown to snakes. Because I'm dressed like a servant. Let go of me. Let go of me. Oh. That's not mine. I've never seen that before in my whole life. Throw them in a barrel of nails. Oh. Arrest them. Cut off their Stop. ears. Arrest them. Princess, I hope you know we have to punish them. We mustn't show weakness. A severe punishment is what's called for. Arrest them. 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 Throw them in the dungeon. Kristen. Until I find out what happened. This is a mistake. There. I'll find out what happened. I'll sort this out. Uh, uh, Espen. I need to talk to Kristen.
Ah, there's no doubt. This is cindergrass. A rare and deadly plant extract. There is no antidote. They will never wake up again. No. <laughs> Your Highness. <laughs> Your Highness, I realize <laughs> this is hard for you to deal with right now. No. <laughs> and it hurts me to have to tell you this, but you'll have to ascend the throne as queen. It's just too soon. I don't think I can. Wait. Hmm? We can still save them. Have you ever heard of Soria Moria? <laughs> the Golden Palace? Yeah. Everybody knows that's just a fairy tale. Well, there's always some truth in all fairy tales. <laughs> They say Soria Moria was built in the spring of the water of life. This water is said to cure absolutely everything. <laughs> this is ridiculous. But how do you know the palace exists? I know the way. You do? Yeah. <gasps> Let me take you there. I think you should consider what's safest and best for your country, princess. We know the Danes are on their way. The kingdom is under attack, so it is of the greatest importance that you remain here. What if something bad happens to you? We'll go to the palace. You remember the way there? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I was wrong. Wrong? I'm only human. See that? See what? We're on the right track. What do you think you're doing? I know someone who maybe knows for sure we're here. You wait here. So, how did it go? The king and the queen are dead. Great. The Danish king will be delighted. That gives us time to organize our troops. But the princess isn't. What? She left for something called the Soria Moria Palace to get the water of life. Soria Moria? Yeah. That's just a tale for fools. So they say, but it seems true now. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, and my payment? Yes, of course. <laughs> you deserve every penny. <laughs> Here you are. Thanks. You're rich, buddy. <laughs> Why don't we take one for the road to celebrate? Yeah! <laughs> ah, no, I really should be going. I should go back to the palace before they suspect. Uh, no, no, no. Uh, no, you must stay. Keep us company. <laughs> <laughs> Hungry? Well, no. You sure? Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, hi there. <laughs> you sure are pretty. Here you go. Yeah. Ooh, That's for one you. for you. Let us drink a toast to this charming little country called Norway. <laughs> Little Norway. <laughs> Cheers! Norway! <laughs> Do 
Do you know the meaning of aquavit? No. It's a Latin word. It means the water of life. Ironic, no? <laughs> so now that that's out of the way, Omen, what happens with the princess, hmm? We'll follow her. If the palace really does exist, then we're in for a treat, my boys. Who are we looking for? An old and frail lady. This is where I met her last time, so I'm sure she lives nearby. You don't even know where she lives? Uh, no. Hey! Oh, hi there. You haven't seen a weird old lady around here, have you? What, you want us to come with you? <laughs> Where do you think you're off to now? You've got to be kidding. Wait up! Is it your idea to be chasing squirrels? Ugh. We're still chasing the squirrel! Oh, great. Are you doing all right? She's trying to shell us something. Come! Uh. We're only running in circles, and that's just... You see? We found it. Hi. Huh. Ash lad? Yeah, it's me. Oh, thank goodness. I need you to unstuck me before I lose my head and my nose. Uh, okay. No uh, problem. Yeah. Try to take a deep breath. Oh. Okay. Come on. Oh. Oh. Third time this week. Ugh. Uh. So, who is this beautiful girl? May I present Princess Kristen? Hi. Kristen, <laughs> this is, uh, uh, the stump woman. No, don't call me that. I may look like I have a tree limb for a nose, but I still have feelings. I'm sorry. Especially when I bend over and get my nose stuck. All right, what can I do for you, Ash lad? We have to find Soria Moria soon. Huh. If it exists. Are you daft? <laughs> Only one person was lucky enough to return from Soria Moria alive. And if he's still alive, I'm sure he must be losing it. And where is he now? You can find him on the far side of Heedle Gorge. Heedle Gorge? <sighs> we will never make it there. There is a waterfall that you can get through. And once you cross it... Yeah? I forgot. No, oh my, oh my, the ancient Voskrimen lives there and he will try to trick you. Mm, then what do we do? I don't... One second. Wait here, I think I have something. Don't touch anything. Okay. I... I wish I lived in a house with just one floor.
What did I say? Ah, uh, that chest contains the souls of my ex-boyfriends. But you're in luck. Because you helped me get free, I'll give you these. Every time you take one step, they will take you seven leagues. Better be careful. Oh, thank you. Thanks a lot, Stump. Uh, friend. Ah, you're very welcome, Ash lad. Now, listen closely to me. A few drops from the water of life can heal anything, but taking a whole sip will give you enormous strength for a short while. But only a short while. Be careful. Now get going. <laughs> Seven League Boots? I should have invented these. Every step will take you seven leagues? Yeah. Isn't that kind of... Dangerous? <sighs> it's okay. That was just a test. That's nuts. Are you okay? Yeah. I wasn't asking you. One more try. Are you sure about this? Yeah. Third time's the charm. Burning these. Still hurts. We're gonna have to face the Hedal Gorge anyway. Compared to the boots, the gorge is easy. He'll be back for us. Espen. He'll. He'll get us out. What if he doesn't make it in time? Remember what the crowd wanted? Throw us in the snake pits with lots of flogging? Cut off our ears. our best soldier. We'd have been safer with Stump Woman. See that? We're not the first ones here. Hey. Steel pot. I can see you. <laughs> Come on. the waterfall I think she lied to us could be around here yeah according to an old woman who likes to talk to squirrels 
say, I'm sure she... Uh, I've got a little plan. I think this is the worst plan ever conceived. At least we've got a plan. To find a senile old man who may not even be alive is supposed to guide us to a place that doesn't exist? When we find the water, we'll also find out who poisoned the wine. Then Pear and Paul will be set free. Okay. You think they're guilty? There's a visitor here for the cute one. Not my words. No, no, no. Uh, wait. I said the cute one. Not you. Huh? The other guy. Yep, that one. Yeah, you got two minutes. <laughs> hey. Hi. <laughs> uh, you see, I baked you a cake. Thank you. <laughs> I know you didn't do anything. But I'm glad I can see you again. <laughs> uh, I'm so sorry. I didn't dance with you. Oh, I'm such no, a klutz. No, 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 I... no. I know I can be too much. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Paul. And I am Sulfred. And I... So is that a... special kind of... Uh, cake? Oh, you bet it's a special cake. So maybe it contains, you say, some ingredients unusual? It's got all of the usual ingredients. Oh yeah, yeah, it's got some unusual ingredients. <laughs> so, chew carefully. Hey, your time is up in there. Oh. I'll grab this. Thanks a lot. The time went by too fast. No, it really didn't. I'll see you soon, okay? I hope so. Take care. <laughs> Don't push me. Hey, hey! What are you doing, you animal? Sulfur made that cake Calm for down. me. Calm down. This cake right here is our way out of this mess. You'll see. <sighs> A comb? Huh, <laughs> how cute. Cute. Hmm? Hmm. Come on. This is it. I can feel it. I feel... I... Soap? Yes. Your girlfriend smuggled in... a comb... and a bar of soap. I'll trade the comb for the soap, okay?
Kristen? Kristen? Where are you going? Kristen? Are you okay? Just travelers that are passing through. Uh, we just wanted to get through the cave behind the waterfall. No, 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 no. I'm the only one who decides who can pass here. Uh, uh, hey, hey, uh, I'll try to. I'm gonna take care of this. Starts crying, even the gods. Well, they cry because it's mediocre, right? As if you could do better. Yeah, I could play that fiddle with my feet. You talk big for a puny human. I'm serious. What do you say we have a competition? <laughs> if I play better than you, you let us pass. Challenge accepted, but if I win, your souls belong to me forever. May the best man win. Ask him. The stump woman said he would try to trick us. I got this. I'll play first. If you're really as good as you say you are, the best goes last. <laughs> Pretty good. For an amateur. You've got a big mouth, stranger. Let's see if you can handle the big stage. Watch your step. I have a feeling things are looking up. Ow! Or maybe not. <laughs> are you okay? Yeah. Pass me the violin. I'm gonna try something.
play some more. I'm sorry. I know you and your brothers are really innocent. I was just mad. Thank you. Look what I found. <laughs> hey, what do you have there? Uh, whatever it is, it stinks. Let me see. Smelling salts. It's what doctors use to wake up patients after they fainted. Oh. Might come in handy the morning after a night out. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Are you the one who's been to Soria Moria Palace? <laughs> no, not me. I'm too young to be him, but you'll find him in there. Hi. Have you been to Soria Moria? Go further in. Hi. Have you been to Soria Moria? Who? Me? Oh, no. You're looking for the father of the house. Hmm. <laughs> oh. I'm fine. Good day. Are you father of the house? And you know the way to Soria Moria, right? You can talk to my father there. <laughs> Excuse me? Huh? Have you ever been to Soria Moria Palace? Soria Moria Palace? Yeah. Have you been there? Yes. Ask oh, my father. On. He's the old guy hanging from the wall. just wondering if you know the way to Soria Moria. If I want to get with Susan Gloria? Soria Moria. Oh. <laughs> Soria Moria. I haven't heard anyone mention that place for 
Many years, too many. But is it true that you've been there? How do you think I've managed to reach the ripe age of 190 and a half and still look good? 190? And a half! It was... <laughs> It was all the water I drank while I was there, you see. I drank the water of life. Could you tell us how to get there? <laughs> this morning, I put a spoonful of porridge into my ear, and that's because I forgot how to eat. <laughs> But it's your lucky day, because I wrote about Soria Moria in my diary. You'll find it just over there, in the cupboard. Where? East of the sun, west of the moon. This is exactly what we need. It even has a map. This looks like we have all we need to find. Let me grab this for you. Highness, I am Captain Ullman, and I'll be taking care of your little kingdom for you. And I presume you are Espen So Sad? Take them! Stay back! Oh, I got it! Around and around, and pull it through. No, not like that. You have to. I said I got it. Danes. Why did it have to be Danes? Uh huh? Come in, please. Uh, take a seat. <clears throat> Feel at home and just help yourselves. We have really good food. I recommend the pork shank. It tastes heavenly. We don't want your food. Why not? Espil? A little taste? No? Great. That means more for me. My kingdom will never be yours. Sadly, the kingdom already belongs to me. But this little gem here interests me now. In Denmark, we have heard stories about Soria Moria. But could they be true? The treasures, the gold, and the water of life. But it's all just a legend. It could be. But we'll soon find out. You were the one who poisoned my parents. You caught me. But it wasn't just me, dear. I did get help from someone you know. From who? I come to share some very good news with the two of you. Espen and Princess Kristen are on a quest to find Soria Moria. Ah, then he's still alive! Indeed, but he won't be getting you out of here. Huh? Mm hmm. Spain? Mm hmm. You're lying. He would never do that to us. Hmm. 
You should be careful about who you trust these days. Don't take it so personally. These things always happen. Somebody has to take the blame for the greater good to occur. <laughs> We're not stupid peasants, you know. You have some nerve. The king trusted you. Come you. Yes, he did. And I like the king. I like him very, very much. I like the royal family, and I'm thankful for them. They're very good people. But you have to know how to play your cards well, and... Unfortunately for all of us, the Danes will seize power sooner or later. What you're doing is high treason. No, what I'm doing is assuring my survival. Wait, what happens to us? You two will not survive. You will be rolled around in a barrel of nails. A barrel of nails? Listen, it could be worse. At least now you know why you have to die and how. Not comforting. And now that you know, I'll be leaving you in peace. I've been such a dolt. A what? She said a dolt. What does that mean? An idiot. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's a good one. A dolt. Better write it down, eh? <laughs> you dolt. No, you're the you dolt. Norwegians <laughs> have such funny words. <laughs> I collect them. <laughs> and what do you call that over there? Potato. Potato. <laughs> <laughs> Did you hear that? Potato. <laughs> oh, okay. And uh, what about those? Scrambled eggs. Scrambled eggs. <laughs> Don't scramble my eggs. My eggs are all scrambled. <laughs> Have you ever heard such a thing? Okay, okay. What about this thing? That's a napkin. Napkin? Hey, what do you think of that? <laughs> so many funny words. Tell me what this is. A sausage. <laughs> <laughs> it's the same word in our language. Get them out of here. <laughs> this isn't over, Omen. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Come. Now you can say, I will die. I will die. <laughs> Hold up. I say we take them all the way up to the mountain. And throw them off the cliff. No, 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 no. Why would we? We'll just do what she told us to. We cut their throats with a knife and then... I got it. Yeah, we tie them to a tree. Cover them no. in honey. So the no, insects don't. will come. I'm They'll not eat giving them you my honey. Think about it. Right? That's right. Come on, prisoners covered in honey. Or we can just kill them, you know? Just kill True. them. True. They escaped? Hello? They're gone? They escaped! Alarm! 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 It's just a fiddle. Oh, how sweet. <laughs> play something for them. Yes, play a little melody. Shiny fiddle. Hey, Stop this! Stop! Oh, hey, oh, what's going on with our bodies? Stop this! Oh, oh. <laughs> What the hell is going on here? Uh, they got away. How is that possible? 
I don't know what happened. We just had to uh, dance. Mm hmm? Dance? Mm hmm. The urge to. <laughs> 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 At least she's in a good mood. Come on, let's have some drinks while we have a look at the book to see where we're going. <laughs> help! You have to help me! A piece of cake got stuck in Paul's throat! Well, he'll be executed anyway, so... Right. Good point. People will pay a lot to watch it. They really look forward to it, and they even bring their families with them. You want to disappoint them? Their families? Yeah, we should mess it up for them. You know, I never thought about it that way. <clears throat> it would be a shame to disappoint right. the children. So. <sighs> you go wait in the corner. I won't fall for the old my brother ate cake and he choked on the fruits knock out the guard trick. I've been fooled that way before. Hey, look at me. Hi. Hi. Hi! Come back here! Alarm! Hi there. What is it? Uh, I'm sorry, sir. The prisoners... Uh, ...are behind you. I've escaped. Yeah? Thank you for your report. I was nice. I confided in you, and you decided to hurt my guard and escape. And so, you'll be executed first thing in the morning. That's that. Please close the gate. Your execution is tomorrow. Well, the children will be happy to see you nail it. Get it? <laughs>
need to get to the island. Which island? I don't know. I didn't get that far in the book. Good morning. Is that your boat? What? Is that your boat? Uh, yes. It's all mine. Could you give us a ride? To where? Well, we don't know exactly, but for sure it's one of those islands. Oh, thank you. The diary said something about sun and moon. Well, this island right here resembles a moon. And this one looks like a sun. East of the sun, west of the moon. Excuse me? Yes? What is this place? Nobody knows for sure. We want you to take us there. I won't do that. It's not safe. Only one person's ever made it out of there alive. Would you be willing to trade your boat for something? Something I have? Depends on what you have to offer me. Yeah. A man like you, with exquisite taste, would probably appreciate this one-of-a-kind bird. <laughs> one-of-a-kind? That's a magpie, boy! <laughs> right. But... I've got something more precious. This thing. The vote is yours. There are advantages to being a princess. Yeah, you're right. Let's go. I don't think we're going to find our way in this fog. Yes, we will. The sun's bound to come out soon. I don't know how you do it. How can you be so positive all the time? <laughs> I'd call it faith. You should try it sometime. You know, if you would like to visit me more often, I wouldn't mind it at all. You mean that? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure your father would approve of that. <laughs> when have I ever listened to him?
Can you see anything? Close. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. You've got some fight in you, huh, Princess? Kristen! Kristen! Kristen!
look at that. We're always running into each other, huh? <laughs> <laughs> I found your belt. <laughs> <laughs> this is the best day of Thank my you. Life. Wait, Gibbis? Gibbis! Let's finish. Whatever. Gibbis! Gibbis! is not big enough for me anymore. Oh With this kind of power, we'd be able to take over the world! Yeah! Imagine a Danish kingdom that stretches all the way from Copenhagen to the very shores of Constantinople. And I... I will sit on the throne. Yeah! 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 <laughs> <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> I can't see anything. Wait a minute. But what is that sweet oh, smell? No. I can smell sweet human <laughs> Delicious, crispy, uh, crunchy human. Hey, troll! Woman. Oh, I'm really scared. I'm the strongest human on the planet. Who are you? I baby? like her in a sandwich. I eat trolls for breakfast. <laughs> uh, I really wouldn't do that if I were you. Why? Because the powers <laughs> don't tend to last. Oh, <laughs> 
King will get to know how clever we are. <laughs> will they give us our eye back? Yeah, we deserve it. Did you hear something? Guard the water. Guard the treasures. They're here somewhere. Steal the treasures. We are not here for the treasure. If that's the case, then why are you here? Because we need the water of life. Mm. My parents were poisoned, and I need to save them. They are going to steal from us. Yes. Not, not so. I'm begging you. Uh, <sighs> no. You don't understand. If we don't guard the water, we'll never get our eye back. Let's eat them and fill our bellies. <laughs> Hold on. Uh, I might have something for you. Uh -huh. Huh? Mm -hmm. I know that smell. What do you have there? Give, Give it, it to us. us. Here. This belongs to you. Can it be true? <laughs> Is it really our eye? <sighs> Is it? <sighs> oh. 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 We can see your video. We can see again. The king and the queen. The parents of Kristen. They are dead. But with all that you have, you three can save the kingdom. All we want is a few drops of the water of life. We will give you some. Wait a minute. I think he smells heavenly. Let me sniff. Shouldn't we rather eat them? No, we have our eye back. Thank you so much. Go now. Go before I change my mind. <laughs> <laughs> Did you hear that? No. Uh, not again, good for nothing nose. I'm delighted to see so many children and families here today. So, we will finally have some painful uh, and uh, spectacular entertainment. Oh, we hope you enjoy watching the agonizing death of these two peasants. <laughs> Thanks so much. Please be respectful and let the children come closer. 
I'm scared, Claire. I am too. So long, brother. <laughs> oh, who wants to have some painful fun? Espen! Pear and Paul are innocent! Advisor Svein is the one behind all of this! Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that is a fat lie. Put that boy under arrest! 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 My sons! Arrest! Arrest! You had a plan? He'd just confess? No. No. It's just bad. So, this time we'll skip the drum roll. We get it. And roll. Ready? Push them roll over. Them, roll, roll, them, them, roll, roll them! Roll them! Roll them! Roll them! Stop roll right them, there! Roll. You will set those brothers free now. <laughs> <laughs> Your Majesty, it's so, so good to see you. I, I think I was, uh, maybe, uh, maybe we could find a way to work together and... Dear people, I thank you from the bottom of my heart. This is for you. Happy birthday, Kristen. I can't believe you. It's not much, but, uh... It belonged to my mom. It's perfect. It is? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. <clears throat> I want to stay with Espen. If you have a problem with that, I give up my right to the throne now. Espen Ashland. Once again, you have proved how much you are willing to do for this kingdom. And if Kristen wants to be with you, who am I to hold her back? <laughs> <laughs> Why are you laughing? Because you're sweet. I'm sure it's only puppy love. Surely it won't last. <laughs> You're with me on that, right? No, this love will last. Hmm? Kato, was I talking to you? Uh uh. Move on. Yeah. Hide your face. Yeah. Hooray! Long live the princess! Hooray! It's so touchy. <laughs> so. Young love. Uh... It's permanent. And, yeah. Oh, okay. It's not that kind of gathering. Sorry, that's just rubbish. There are certain limits. But it's nice. Still, you can't pick up things like me. Are you scared I'll be better than you? <laughs> I, I know you'll be better than me. 
I don't know if you can find great things. Well, I found you. Look all around you, Mickelson. It's ours! <laughs> we are the richest people in the whole wide world! Ah! We are rich beyond our wildest <laughs> dreams! Finally, food and bath! <laughs> no, 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 no. 